basketball. And we start off the summer of hoops here on NBA TV with the Atlanta Hawks and the Memphis Grizzlies. The Grizzlies, of course, the great house. They want to get back to that style of play. Also like to score just 99 points a game a season ago. And David, you crunch those numbers a lot. The second lowest in the West. They're very optimistic, though. You saw Jackson hit the three right there, that they're going to be able to have a lineup with Jackson, Gasol, as their bigs. And then they've got five shooters on the floor. And there's another three there by Jackson. That's two in a row. Boy, didn't waste any time. Looks at his hands. Yeah. Like, yes, yes, sir, it did go down. Jaron right. Jackson, a couple of threes. The fourth overall pick just a month ago. That ball slapped away and nearly saved baseline. That's Jaron Jackson's defense right there. That ball flies in, no foul. Jackson. And that was a tough shot by Jackson. Yeah, that's his third of the night. There's a young man with a bright future, Jaron Jackson. Well, that's the wingspan we're talking about here. This is the prototypical NBA player one day. 40% from three, 6'11", 236. And then the, the key word, switchable. With his length and his athleticism, should be able to switch one through four and maybe even one through five. We saw in the NBA playoffs, by the time the Rockets and the Warriors played, every single pick, whether it was on ball or off ball, was being switched. And a lot of times, you don't have to, the, the amount of time that you require to switch doesn't Jaron Jackson drops the ball, hounded by the Hawks at midcourt, and got the shot away and goes for 13 points in his first half debut. We knew about his three-point ability at 40% at Michigan State. That's a marvelous shot for a 6'11 big man. David, you just said and you've got to play multiple spots right in this league from here on out and the big guy can prove he can go outside or in. I think the size is the issue as much as anything. It, he's only six foot two and he's not particularly long. So I think we've seen a few times where that shooting window closes on him. How about back inside after the miss three? Jaron Jackson Jr. Nice block, starts a break. Hawks come the other way. Spellman's been really good tonight. He does have that shot block ability. Ball comes off the rim and Memphis is gonna push with Simmons. We hit the seven minute mark and there, David, right on cue, the big fella decides instead of putting the ball on the floor, he's just gonna put up a three and he's gonna go to the line as Collins picks up another foul. Left hand dribble back out, big fella wants three, up and in. I'm well, impressed. You're impressed. With, you're impressed and I guess we, you can say yes, he can shoot the three point shot. Ball drop, picked up. Oh, another three. Jackson with 20 range. When I'm talking to the coaches last night, David, they said we are going to be better. Please. Jackson gets it back behind. What, what do you bet the three-point line? He'll take that shot one more time. 